New Orleans Saints continue to suffer discouraging losses to the point where they're now below 500 on the season for the first time. To understand how the group is trying to get out of this slump, let's check in with our Saints insider, Sarah Polcheski. The New Orleans offense has struggled with being on the same page all season. Those frustrations seem to hit a boiling point and last Thursday's loss to the Jaguars, where the players were wearing their emotions on their sleeves, including a very animated quarterback, Derek Carr. The Saints say it's easy to point fingers from the outside. However, they're remaining together and having difficult conversations as they work towards getting on the same page and becoming the team they believe they can be. I was FaceTiming all the guys on offense talking, I mean, talking to you know, all the guys, the leaders, the, the things, and we're demanding from each other. We're, we're encouraging one another. We don't have to hide and not talk about it. Let's just get it out there. What's your problem? What's my problem? What's, the, what's our problem? Now, how do we fix it? We put it out there. We said what we needed to say. Everyone felt good leaving the conversation. There's no point in fingers. My takeaway was unity and a lot of guys solving problems. Not just saying we were. We really were putting the work in. We're, we're absolutely together. I mean, sometimes you got to show a little tough love. That's just how it is. Um, and I think everybody on the offense wants to get the problem fixed. They want to be part of the solution. So, I mean, there's not a, there's not a reason for concern. The Saints say they have started to look at how they prepare through the week as one way to get back on the same page. That includes in how they meet and how they practice, including maybe spending extra time out on the field together, getting those extra reps in. Reporting from the Saints practice facility for your Go Black and Gold, I'm Sarah Polcheski.